Hello kitties, kiddos, wee yogis. This one is for you. How's everybody doing? How's homeschooling going? I've got my homeschooling tea on today. It's our library cart. This is how we roll. So I thought I'd come on and do a kids, kids practice today for all the kids and moms that are at home and need some ideas for uh, exercise and calming, of course. I've got my stretchy fidget string. This is my fidget string. It's like a big long worm I can do my stretches on, but also just play with. I highly recommend they can do lots of exercises with it, but it's also just fun. It's kind of like rubbery. So I thought maybe we could do a kid's sun salutation today. So this is something that when I teach it in class, I tell the kids that this is like an exercise they could get, get up in the morning and do, or when they get home from school and they need to release some energy that they could do maybe three all the way up to 10 sun salutations. And there, there they go. Their exercise uh, is done for the day. So if any of you parents aren't familiar with the sun salutation, um, then you can maybe take a look at this video too to see how this flow of postures uh, goes. All right, so I'm gonna put my little fidget string down. I'm gonna slide back to the mat and try to catch, I'm gonna try to catch um, all the poses as best I can um, with the camera, but I will uh, move you along through it as well with my words. So we're gonna start on the mat and we're gonna start in a standing position. So we'll go through it nice and slow to begin. So we're gonna start with a deep breath in and send your hands all the way up to the ceiling. So we're reaching up for the sun, hence sun salutation. So kids reach up all the way to the sun, wave hello, like a big strong and tall mountain. And then what I want you to do is just waterfall yourself all the way down and tickle your toes. So you're like a big limp rag doll here and you can tickle your toes you're just a, all your arms and your head, everything's nice and heavy. And then take your hands and put them right down on the mat. And I want you to step one foot back and then the other. So you're up into your downward dog. And then I want you to shift forward to come into plank pose. So see how my back is nice and flat like a plank, like you would walk the plank on a pirate ship. And then you can drop your knees down, uncurl your toes, drop your belly down all the way to the mat, even your chin, and bring your hands at your side into like where you would maybe do a push up. And you're just gonna push yourself up into your snake or your cobra. Maybe let out a little snake sound. And then lower yourself back down, curl your toes again. So you come back up into that down dog. I'll move myself back up. So you're back in your down dog. From here, what I want you to do is step one foot up, then the other foot up. You're back in that rag doll pose where you can tickle your toes. And then you're gonna bring your arms all the way back up overhead to wave to the sun again. Good. So kids and parents, that's one sun salutation or one version. There's lots of different versions of your sun salutation, but that's one example that um, is easy for the kids to remember. So like I said, we could go through that a few times and you'll see, even just from my one time, because I'm talking at the same time, it starts to get your energy flowing. It starts to get your heart beating. So let's try it again and we'll try to go all the way through a little bit quicker. So standing on your mat, nice and tall, mountain pose, Big breath in, send the arms all the way up, high mountain, reach and wave for the sun. Then fold all the way down, tickle your toes in your ragdoll pose. Hands come to the mat, step your feet back, downward dog. 
Raise your hips up to the sky. Good, slide forward, plank pose. Drop your knees, drop your belly, drop your chin. Put your arms right down by your chest and push up into your cobra. Little breath work there. Slide back down. Curl the toes, press up. Peel your hips up to your down dog again. You can let out a nice big doggy howl if you'd like to here. And then step one foot up, the other foot up, and nice and slowly roll yourself all the way back up to standing. Good stuff. Let's try that one last time, even faster. So big breath in, all the way up. Reach for the sun, big high mountain, and then all the way back down, ragdoll. Hands go on the mat, let's jump back this time. So we're gonna put our hands on the mat, we're gonna jump back into our down dog. That's kind of fun, right? And then push ourselves forward, plank pose. Let's lower ourselves down all the way this time. Good. Press up into your snake. Good, back down to your chin, curl your toes, downward dog's coming next, all the way up, peel those hips up to the sky. Let's try that jump again like we did before. So we're gonna jump up to our hands, bend your knees and jump. Good, ragdoll pose. And then nice and slowly, we'll peel it all the way up. We'll bring our hands together at our heart. You guys can stay standing if you'd like, but I'm gonna come down to you. Do you feel your, put your hand on your heart, maybe one on your belly. Oh, do you feel your heart beating? I can feel mine beating. So if you don't yet, do that a few more times. Watch the video from the beginning again and try those um, poses. Try those poses in your sun salutation again. Great workout and moms and dads gets their energy moving for the day, right? Or gets the rest of their energy out if you've had one of those days that you haven't got outside. So anyway, everybody, whew, clap your hands together. May you be happy, may you be healthy, and may you be whole. Take care, everybody. Namaste. Feel free to uh, send a like down below or comments of what you would like to see in future videos for kids or for adults. Um, and subscribe so you stay up to date on any new videos that are released. Good luck, mamas. Good luck, dadas. Take care.